This is Anaya543, and today I'm going to show you how to make your own cursor, like the one that I made. Alright, you're only going to need one program for this, and that is Icon Art. Um, I'll put a link in the description for where you can download it. Alright, when you get Icon Art, you get something that looks like this. And, um, <coughs> sorry. Uh, what you basically do is you can draw whatever you want. Say you want to make your cursor a splotch. Ta-da, there's your cursor. Um, Alright, so, file, new project, no. Alright, now, single frame, that's basically what we want to do, single frame. Alright, now you have this frame. What are you going to do with it? It's blank. Well, if you want to make a splotch, Usually, probably, this is just basically how to make a sprite as your icon. So what you're going to do is you're going to go File, Import from File, and then you'll be brought to your File when, when your, your My Pictures folder. Go find the picture you want. Uh, I think I'm going to choose... Let's choose a picture... Alright, let's use Sunburst Warrior. Alright, so now you have them. Now you get to use this, using this select tool, this tool, you can select what part of the sprite you want. I like doing like the head, like this. And once you've got it, go over here and click this check mark. And voila, there you are. There you have your sprite. But you got all this white in the background. And that's what it looks like. You don't want it to look like this, because then you'll have this white in the background. So what you want to do is you want to find the mark color. I suggest to set the mark color you go select a color like this and then go and then click this arrow right here which means select as mark color and now this is our mark color and our mark color means that it won't be shown so now using this box this tool right here you can fill in fill in all this that you don't want with the pink this is the part that takes the most amount of time, so yeah. There, now that now that you have it, you go file, save icon. Oh no, sorry, not save icon. File, save frame as cursor. Now you can save it wherever you want. I'm gonna save it to the desktop as sample. Sample. Sample, whatever. Save. Alright, um, here we are. Here's our sample. It's right there. It's in our corner right there. So now we're going to go to Start. Control Panel. Printers and other hardware. Mouse. Pointers. And now, say, okay, we're going to go here. And we're going to go Browse. Click Browse. You go here, now you want to go to your desktop, so you just keep clicking this button, the up button. Click on my documents. Uh, we're going to find... Desktop, right there. And here's our sample, double click sample. And there is our cursor. Now we're going to click apply. Okay. Now obviously yours won't have all this white because I chose to I chose not to show you the whole white getting rid of thing. So um there you have it. There's your cursor. Um uh maybe if you guys make requests I'll make another tutorial on how to make it animated. Uh I don't know. All right. Thanks for watching.